To begin with, we'll draw the scapula, we'll draw the humerus in the brachium, the arm region, and then in the antebrachium we'll draw the ulna and the radius. The carpal region will draw the carpal bones, the metacarpus will draw the metacarpal bones, and we'll finish off with the phalanges of the digits. The first muscle we'll draw is the subscapularis from the medial aspect of the scapula to the proximal medial aspect of the humerus. Then the subscapularis is innervated by the subscapular nerve. Next we'll draw the supraspinatus muscle and that goes from the supraspinous fossa of the scapula to the greater tubercle, the proximal humerus, and the infraspinatus which goes from the infraspinous fossa also the greater tubercle, the proximal humerus. Both of these muscles are innervated by the suprascapular nerve. The next muscle we'll draw is the teres major, and this will go from the dorsal caudal scapula to the proximal medial humerus, and we'll also draw the deltoideus, which runs from the scapular spine and the chromion to the lateral aspect of the humerus. Both of these muscles are innervated by the axillary nerve. Next we'll draw the triceps and these span from the distal caudal border of the scapula and the lateral caudal and medial aspects of the proximal humerus and they all insert on the olecranon tuber. The antebrachial extensors begin from the lateral epicondylar area and they extend across the dorsal aspect of the carpal joints, the carpal metacarpal joints, and the interphalangeal joints. And these are all both innervated by the radial nerve. The biceps brachii spans between the superglenoid tubercle of the distal cranial scapula to the proximal cranial, medial, radius, and ulna. The brachialis spans between the proximal caudal lateral humerus, and this also inserts on the proximal cranial, medial, radius, and ulna. Both of these muscles are innervated by the musculocutaneous nerve. The antibrachial flexors originate from the medial epicondylar area and the proximal ulna and radius, and they span across the palmar aspect of the carpal joints the metacarpal phalangeal and interphalangeal joints. These muscles are innervated by the median and ulnar nerve.